Hey guys, Lee's Product Reviews here. I have gotten a few comments with additional questions and uh, wanting to know some more information about the Z8 MN56 Mini PC, uh, including uh, some more specifics around the dimensions and uh, a look at the inside. So I thought we would do that now. So dimension wise across, four and a half inches by four and an eighth inches so not quite a perfect square but pretty close um, does have four screws here in the bottom so I thought we would just start to dig in and see what we have inside so let me get my screwdriver here and we will start to get inside so I know some of the questions were like are some of the are the components inside soldered? Are they user replaceable? What's in there um, in terms of expansion? Um, so I don't know that off the top of my head, so we will be figuring those questions out together. So some rubber feet, and let's see if that loosens things up. So I'm kind of figuring this out at the same time. So if there's another get something to one moment let me get another tool all right I'm back here I'm just gonna get a couple of items to see here I can get something wedged in here to separate the case from the actual components All right, so inside, I see two RAM slots. We have your um, memory or, uh, storage. So there is a replaceable SSD. M2. Um, I'm not sure what brand or model this is, but it's got a big heat seek on it. Um, below that, you have your wireless card, which does appear to be replaceable. And then there is another slot here for, um, I believe, a smaller type of card. I forget what they are called the small size ones but it looks like there is room for another slot there um, two memory slots they are replaceable uh, so all in all it's nothing nothing appears uh, to be soldered in except maybe the processor and to get to that I'm not sure what at all let me, let me just take a quick peek here Maybe we can get to the bottom and no, if you install the extra memory. Appears like I would have to remove the posts. I do believe, guys, I'm going to stop there. I don't know that I want to go any deeper. It's have to remove tape and sides and uh, potentially uh, be more destructive than I want to this. Um, but in terms of easy access, replaceable options, you can swap out the memory for some uh, bigger sticks. This has two 8 gig sticks. It does have an SSD M2 here, and then there is spot for a smaller one um, as well. And I will, um, I will uh, post this to my YouTube so you guys can see these answers and uh, take from that what you will. I hope this was helpful. Appreciate it, guys.